My, my. I was wondering when I was going to see you again. You look different. Well, the rigors of simplicity take their toll on a woman. Oh, no, I didn't mean well, it. I know. Things are going well. I couldn't have done it without you. Oh, you did it all yourself. <coughs> so how are you holding up? Uh, I'm still standing, which is an improvement on the last time you saw me. I wish that there was something else that I could do. Ma'am, you have done more than enough. Please, call me Charlotte. Arthur. Arthur Morgan. Well, you take care of yourself, Arthur. Well, please, go on in and help yourself to anything you need. What's mine is yours. Oh, well, that's very kind. Hello, Charles. Thank you for coming. Of course. The chief, he's, uh... He, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, yes. Why, well, I can He's in his tent. Joe, sure. I'll wait for you here. Come in. <clears throat> Mr. Morgan, I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? My son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. 
A little. <laughs> He's very brave. Very angry. <laughs> He's me. How is your father? He's dead a long time. He uh, lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. He is the chief son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? And people who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more, that's treason. Well. What should I do? I don't think there's much chance reasoning with Colonel Favors. No. In any chance we had, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the Army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. But matters are more complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes, yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. I need to get his son back, of course. I just ain't sure how. I've been working on that. I think there's a way. Follow me. Anyway. What? I've been scouting the fort. The army are patrolling all the main roads and bridges in and out, but if we can get the horses across the river, I found a route that should get us in fairly close. If we wait until late enough, there's a place we should be able to sneak in around the back. Okay, whatever you think. I trust you. No guns, just knives and arrows. If we start making a lot of noise, he'll be dead before we get close to him. Okay. I left two canoes down river, in case we need another way out of there. Okay, good. <laughs> You know, this wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for Dutch. It ain't just on Dutch. We all went along with it. He saw Eagle Flies burn hot, and he fanned the flames. He's not helping that tribe, he's helping himself. You see that, or you wouldn't have gone to Rain's fall behind his back. I guess I just keep thinking. There must be a way to save the situation. To pull Dutch out of the place he's in. Well, uh... I like Rain's Fall. I don't know, Arthur. Rain's Fall is in a tough situation. And that's for Dutch. <sighs> I gotta try. I own that, at least. You feel that? There's rain on the wind. I know. Listen, Charles. If it goes bad in there, you can get yourself out. You got me. More to lose. No. Come on. Don't start talking like that. Uh, I didn't tell you before, but... I saw it, Doc. It's pretty bad. And it's gonna get worse. Oh, Arthur. Any day we can die, hmm? We're riding to break an Indian chief's son out of a cavalry fort. We could both die tonight. In a way... It is a gift to know. In a way, you are lucky. Sure don't feel like that. You still have time to make amends. The others, Hosea, Lenny, Sean, all of them, they didn't. And what about the calendar boys? Both killed trying to escape Blackwater? More fishes pair of bastards than ever was. 
That's all they ever were and will be. Maybe. You're lucky. You got the chance to... to do something better. My guess is maybe that's why you're here now. Either way, just keep your head strong. We're close now. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. That current's strong. Up here. Follow me. Uh, you were right about the damn rain. Mm hmm Yeah. But might help us with sneaking in there. The Rainsfall told me there was some retaliation after the meeting with Colonel Favors. Some women were taken. Elders beaten. Bastards. Yeah. This isn't gonna be nice. There it is. Should be fine. Let's get ourselves hidden and wait till it gets dark. Over here. I guess this is it. I guess it is. Let's keep quiet. We'll try and find our way in. Main thing is that they don't hear us. You ready? Control group. Hopefully we'll be in and out before they can come back around. There's two guards out front. If you take one, I'll take the other. Nice and quiet. Nice and quiet. Well, we have two more ahead. One down here, one up in the tower. Let's take one each again. Arthur. Good. Just a bit further on here. This is the spot. This one's mine.
back while I check the tower. Come on, we're good. Another one out there. You got him? I'll handle it. Try to put an arrow into the lantern above that stack of wood over there. Start a fire. You should have a clear shot from the walkway up there. Morgan? Charles? Is that you? Look for the keys. You have to get me out of here. We're gonna get you out. At the table, Arthur. You search the body. Got him. Father sent us. My father. He told you to come and kill guards? No, he didn't say that, he Of course not. You okay? Sure. Enjoy being tortured. Clears the mind. If you say so. Oh, whoa, no. whoa. I'm fine, I'm fine.
We lost them. Come on. <coughs> you okay, Arthur? Yeah, I'm right as rain. How are you? <clears throat> I'll be fine in a day or so. I heal fast. Colonel Favors won't be too happy with your rescue. I guess not. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot more trouble. 
My father, even he may have to fight. You won't win. No big fight with them. Shouldn't y'all just run away? Where would we go? I don't know. I'm fine. Let me take you back to your father. Hmm? Thank you. No mention. Yeah. Here. Yep. Okay, boy. Yeah. Here's the kind soul I was telling you about. The one that, uh, got the venom out of your <clears> leg? <throat> mm -hmm. I guess so. Listen, friend, I know I can never repay you, but... How about you head over to the gunsmith and pick out your choice of item on my tab? Oh, well, thanks. Yeah, seemed like the least I could do. With him being sent straight from the Almighty to save my life. Yeah. Hey, what can I do for you? Fitter outside told me I could grab something on his tab. The one with the bite in his leg. Ah, oh, Norbert, huh? Well, he's good for it. About all he's good for between the two of us. <laughs> well, take a look around. Find something you like, I'll put it on his tab.
Fine choice. I'll let them know. Bye now. Mister? Wanna buy something? I'll take a paper, please. Next time. You, uh, need more time before you buy? Why are you staring? I remind you of somebody? Excuse me. You better not be contagious. Howdy. New in town? I only keep select items on the shelves. Gum and candies behind the shelf. And the medicine and tonics are on the table against the wall. See the catalog if you can't find what you're looking for. Just show me what you want, I'll fetch it right up. Mmm. Guaranteed. Thank you, Doc. Thanks. Hey, your money's as good as mine. Oh, shit. Valentine. Oh, they should have called this dump Turd Town. I mean, I remember when this place was so wild. Welcome. Even the wolves were scared. Got something in mind? Anything to drink. Fresh blood. A little too much. Now, all about churches and shops and all this other bullshit. America, you're toast. What kind of men are you, hmm? Mama's boys, whiners, complainers. I had a complainer once, and now west of, on the trail. You need a haircut more than a drink, I reckon. We sold his labor to the Looking engines. Looking mighty fine. And then we ate him when it got cold. And I'll tell you what, he tasted like shit. Which was only about right, because he was a turd of a man. God damn, turd. Hey, Quentin! 
I took a piss in your chair again. I really hope you're joking. Damn near a work of art. Place is a dump. You are just in Europe. We don't want you here. This place was for well, real men. Man. You're glad you stopped by. Men who could I went up drink. There. Men who could this place fight. Thank you for Step. your help. We got men who Here's my bed. Thank you. Hello, sir. 